For decades, the United States has dominated the global conversation on fighter jet supremacy. America's military power has been represented by some of the most advanced and expensive jets in the world, like the F-22 Raptor and the F-35 Lightning II. These jets were considered the epitome of modern aviation technology, boasting stealth, advanced avionics, and unmatched combat capabilities. According to the narrative pushed by defense experts and manufacturers, these aircraft were practically invincible, designed to dominate the skies and redefine what fighter jets could do. The story was clear. The US was not just leading the charge in air superiority. They were miles ahead of everyone else, but what if the narrative we've been fed is not entirely true? What if America's claim to the crown of aerial warfare was built on a carefully crafted illusion? Enter the Saab Gripen E, a jet from Sweden that has quietly risen to challenge the narrative surrounding US dominance in the skies. Despite being overshadowed by the more famous American jets, the Gripen E has begun to reveal a series of cracks in the F-35's and F-22's reputation, exposing weaknesses in areas that were previously believed to be their strengths. The Gripen E isn't just another fighter jet. It's a modern marvel that has turned the tables, forcing us to reconsider what really defines air superiority. The F-35, for all its marketing and technological prowess, was sold as a one-size-fits-all solution, a fighter capable of excelling in every role, from air-to-air -air combat, to ground strikes, intelligence gathering, and even stealth operations. But as the Gripen E's capabilities have come to light, it's clear that these claims may have been exaggerated. The Gripen E challenges the narrative by offering a more cost-effective, versatile, and efficient solution to modern aerial combat. It's smaller, more agile, and designed to operate from shorter, less sophisticated airstrips. Features that make it more accessible and practical than the more expensive, stealth-heavy F-35. While the F-35 was touted as the ultimate stealth fighter, capable of evading radar detection and infiltrating enemy airspace with impunity, the Gripen E has proven that stealth alone isn't the end-all be-all in modern combat. The Gripen E's design prioritizes agility, speed, and versatility, attributes that can outmaneuver and outlast larger, heavier jets like the F-35 in certain combat scenarios. The Swedish jet has proven that air superiority isn't just about stealth and advanced tech. It's about a balanced, multifaceted approach to warfare that includes reliability, operational cost, and performance under real-world conditions. This brings us to the core of the lie. The F-35, despite its touted capabilities, has faced a multitude of challenges and limitations in real-world testing. The jet's stealth features, while impressive on paper, often come with trade-offs in agility, payload, and range. Additionally, the F-35's maintenance costs and serviceability have been a point of contention within the military community. Despite being billed as the next-gen fighter, it's already facing significant issues in terms of its performance, reliability, and readiness. The Gripen E, in contrast, offers a leaner, more efficient alternative that doesn't compromise on key performance factors like agility and versatility. In the end, it's clear that the Gripen E has exposed a critical flaw in the US narrative. The belief that America's most advanced jets, like the F-35, were the undisputed leaders in modern aerial combat has been shaken to its core. 
The Gripen E's rise has revealed that true air superiority is not about expensive, highly specialized aircraft that can't be operated in a variety of settings. Instead, it's about creating a fighter that combines affordability, flexibility, and raw combat power. Exactly what the Gripen E delivers. The Gripen E doesn't just compete with the F-35 in terms of agility and versatility, it also does so at a fraction of the cost. While the F-35's price tag has been a significant point of contention, the Gripen E offers a more affordable solution for air forces that need powerful jets without breaking the bank. The Gripen E is not just a cheaper alternative, it is a smarter one. While the F-35 requires extensive infrastructure and long, costly maintenance cycles, the Gripen E can operate from short, makeshift airstrips and requires far less maintenance, making it ideal for rapid deployment and sustained operations in a variety of combat scenarios. One of the major claims made about the F-35 is its supposed unmatched stealth capabilities. However, as the Gripen E continues to demonstrate, stealth is not the magic bullet it was once thought to be. The F-35's stealth is often praised, but the reality of how effective that stealth is in real-world combat situations is up for debate. In fact, Stealth features come with their own set of limitations. Primarily, the aircraft's reduced agility, slower speeds, and lower payload capacity. These factors make the F-35 more vulnerable in some situations than originally anticipated. In contrast, the Gripen E sacrifices some stealth in favor of greater speed, maneuverability, and adaptability traits that allow it to excel in a wider range of combat scenarios. The Gripen E's ability to carry out complex missions, including precision strikes and electronic warfare, while maintaining a high level of agility and operational readiness, directly challenges the notion that stealth alone defines air superiority. The Swedish jet has demonstrated that an aircraft does not need to be cloaked in radar evading technology to be effective on the battlefield. Instead, what matters most is how well an aircraft can perform under pressure, how fast it can get to the fight, and how efficiently it can adapt to shifting operational demands. The Gripen E, in this respect, offers a more balanced approach to aerial combat that doesn't rely solely on the elusive concept of stealth. Another area where the F-35 falls short is in its maintenance and operational costs. Despite its cutting-edge technology, the F-35 has been plagued with maintenance issues and high operational costs that have made it less effective than originally promised. The reality of maintaining such a complex aircraft in a sustained combat environment is far more expensive and time-consuming than the US military had anticipated. On the other hand, the Gripen E has been designed with practicality in mind. It features an innovative and simple design that allows for quicker turnaround times and easier maintenance, ensuring that it remains ready for action without draining valuable resources. Perhaps one of the most significant flaws in the F-35's narrative is its lack of true versatility. The F-35 was designed as a multi-role fighter, capable of performing a variety of tasks across different environments. However, its performance in some of those roles has been disappointing. For example, its air-to-air -air capabilities have been questioned by some analysts, as the F-35 is not as agile or capable in dogfights as other modern fighter jets. In contrast, 
the Gripen E excels in air-to-air -air combat, offering superior maneuverability and high-speed performance in close-range engagements. This makes it a far more versatile option for air forces that require flexibility in combat operations rather than a one-size-fits-all solution. In short, the Gripen E has shown that true air superiority isn't about the most expensive jet or the one with the most advanced stealth technology. It's about creating an aircraft that can do it all. It's about a jet that can operate in a variety of conditions, carry out complex missions, and remain combat ready at a fraction of the cost of its American counterparts. The Gripen E's rise isn't just a wake-up call for the US. It's a demonstration of what truly defines modern aerial combat. Adaptability, efficiency, and a fighter's ability to perform in a wide range of combat scenarios, not just on paper, but in real-world operations. As the Gripen E continues to challenge conventional wisdom, it forces a re-evaluation of what the future of air combat truly looks like. The F-35 was sold to the world as the perfect embodiment of technological progress, with a promise of unrivaled performance in every conceivable combat role. However, in practice, the F-35 has failed to live up to these lofty expectations. While the aircraft's stealth and sensor systems are undeniably advanced, they come at a steep price, in both operational costs and combat effectiveness. The Gripen E, by comparison, offers the same technological sophistication, but in a far more practical and affordable package, proving that sheer technological complexity does not always equate to battlefield superiority. In fact, the Gripen E has exposed a fundamental flaw in the F-35's design philosophy. The idea that more advanced technology always equals better performance. While the F-35's cutting-edge sensors and stealth may be effective in certain situations, the Gripen E has proven that a fighter jet's true worth lies in its ability to outmaneuver and outlast its adversaries in real-world combat scenarios. The Gripen E's exceptional agility, high-speed capabilities, and impressive payload make it a far more effective platform in a wide range of combat scenarios, particularly when operating in contested environments where stealth and high-tech systems may not always be enough. The Swedish aircraft's ability to operate in austere conditions also offers a significant advantage over the F-35, which requires specialized airstrips and extensive infrastructure for optimal performance. The Gripen E, with its shorter takeoff and landing requirements, can operate from smaller, less developed airstrips making it far more adaptable in a variety of combat theatres. This flexibility makes it ideal for rapid deployment and quick reaction times in situations where every second counts. In comparison, the F-35's reliance on large, highly equipped bases limits its operational reach, making it less suited for fast-moving or dynamic combat scenarios. Beyond its tactical advantages, the Gripen E's operational cost-effectiveness has become a key selling point. As the F-35 program has experienced cost overruns, delays, and mounting maintenance challenges, the Gripen E has proven that a modern fighter jet can be both high-performance and budget-friendly. The Gripen E's low acquisition and maintenance costs have allowed countries with smaller defense budgets to acquire advanced air capabilities without being financially burdened by the exorbitant costs associated with the F-35. This makes the Gripen E not only a practical choice for established military powers, but also an attractive option for emerging air forces 
looking to modernize their fleets without breaking the bank. At the heart of the Gripen E's challenge to the F-35's dominance is its ability to adapt to rapidly changing combat environments. While the F-35 was designed as a multi-role fighter capable of performing a variety of tasks, its performance in each role has often fallen short. Whether in air-to-air -air combat, strike missions, or intelligence gathering, the F-35 has faced criticism for its limitations in specific areas. The Gripen E, on the other hand, excels in a variety of combat roles, offering a balance of speed, agility, and firepower that allows it to perform exceptionally well in diverse scenarios. This adaptability is crucial in the unpredictable nature of modern warfare, where success is often determined by an aircraft's ability to respond to rapidly changing tactical situations. The Gripen E's versatility, combined with its low operating costs and high combat readiness, gives it a significant edge over the F-35 in this regard. As the Gripen E continues to rise in prominence, it's clear that the future of air superiority may not rest in the hands of the most expensive or technologically advanced jets. Instead, it may be the aircraft that best combines efficiency, versatility, and affordability that will dominate the skies. The Gripen E has not only exposed the weaknesses in the F-35's performance and design, but also demonstrated a new paradigm for what makes a fighter jet truly superior. It's no longer about the size of the budget or the complexity of the technology. It's about the ability to perform, adapt, and prevail in the most demanding of combat environments. And in this respect, the Gripen E has already proven itself to be more than just a challenger. It's a game changer 